I had a, um, an older gentleman, a client that was 86 years old, and he's had neuropathy in his legs for over 30 years. Mm. Um, and he even has a drop foot, his one foot's drop foot, and he, he has like some kind of brace and, you know, he doesn't use a walker, but uses a cane. But when he came in, so I thought I was treating him for neuropathy when he came in. Dr. Bales, I could not believe my eyes. His legs and feet were all black. I mean, solid black from his knees down to the bottom of his feet. And I was like, um, I think maybe you, you need to go to the doctors. Have you, you've been to the doctor, you know, the medical doctor? And his wife piped in and she's like, no, no. She said, because after he gets a shower, she said, they turn normal color. They just get like this whenever he sits for a long time. Well, that was his 20 minute drive to my office from their house. So that was kind of scary. <laughs> But I did just start treating him normally would for the, you know, he's there. I'm going to start treating him. So I started treating him like we would for the neuropathy, you know, you know, the areas that you would for neuropathy. And when he came back the second time, his second treatment, I noticed that it was kind of variegated, but they were still black, but it was almost like multicolored. I don't know how to explain it, but it wasn't solid black anymore. It was like just um, blotchy. Okay. So the second time he came, it was more blotchy. So it wasn't, wasn't solid black anymore. And after we did that treatment, the second treatment, and he came back, so it would have been his third time, it was almost all gone. He, his feet, maybe just a little bit. And after we did the third treatment, by the time he came back for the fourth treatment, his legs were completely normal. Mm -hmm. um, and I, I, I mean, if, I wish I would have taken a picture. I don't think anybody yeah. would have believed how solid black these were. I mean, circulation was horrible. So Firefly got his circulation going really well. My favorite is a 21 year old who came in, um, I think maybe our third week of having Firefly, born with cerebral palsy. Um, kind of some of his symptoms were he walked with a limp, he uh, uh, had a stutter, and then he also, uh, his left arm, he held it, you know, kind of like it was broken. So he really, he showed Rachel worked on him. He couldn't move his arm much above two inches away from his body. And uh, he's a, a big energy, he's an indigo child, and he really is clear on his mission, which is to work with veterans for PTSD. And so when he came in, he said, you know, I don't feel like I can do my mission uh, because my body, I'm trapped in this body. And so um, we worked on him, on his gut and his head, uh, 10 minutes each, again, alternating. So 10 minutes, uh, one treatment, and then the next time he came in working on his head. And after three treatments, stutter almost completely gone. Um, his walking improved. So he was dragging his leg that, that stopped. But the biggest one was when he showed Rachel, he said, look, Rachel, I can move my arm above my head, yeah. all the way above my head. And again, he was born with this. So these are new sensations now in his body, um, which oh is incredible. God. But the thing that brought me to, to tears oh. was he said he actually feels like he can fulfill his purpose now. So he doesn't feel like he's trapped in this constraint that he was born into and he's been coming out of it. This other lady, she's a patient of mine in Cairo, um, knee issue. They wanted to do a knee replacement five years ago. Like she's 76 years old. And we started uh, doing the firefly. And now um, with, I don't even do the knee. Well, now I do it, but I wasn't doing it. Uh, knee got better because all the leg muscle in AK relates to small intestine, large intestine, right? So if you fix the gut, will strengthen the knee, the, the knee muscle, right? So now she, the knee pain is is gone. She she was she always had that clicking in the morning. Doesn't have it anymore. She's back on her or doing her re, uh, recumbent bicycle. Um, her vision is coming back. She had a hard time on a street light to see the light, the, the color clearly. Now it's sharp and crisp. She can see them. She can thread needle. She couldn't do it before. She can see numbers better. Um, and now today she told me um, at the gym, she started adding weight to her knee, like five pounds. Um, and he agreed. So he came in, we ran a scan. And then I actually treated his lungs. You know, on his back and then I did um ransom over his actual his gut as well and she said by the next day that cough was 90 percent improved wow and he had, had it for a year he had had it over a year wow. yes so I've already treated I'm actually going to see him for his third time today oh that's so perfect. he believed in it well enough to come back
that I just truly feel like I am emotionally liberated and I'm able to really reclaim my you know right to feel healthy and I truly attribute this to the diagnosis and the treatment that Dr. Bales and Dr. Bita were able to pinpoint when I went to visit them because I see I've seen many functional medicine doctors, homeopathic doctors, naturopathic doctors, allopathic doctors, chiropractic doctors, you name it. I did my homework to get to the bottom of this and finally this device, this technology is able to read the frequencies of what's going on in our in our in our bodies and target it in an extremely effective way, one treatment. So today I came back, um, it's been just about over a week because I've been really excited um, to retest myself through the F-Scan to compare notes. I was really skeptical at first, but within just a couple treatments, I started to see real difference in it. Something that we had been battling for literally a year and a half with, with high doses of, of different types of uh, medications, whether they be pharmaceutical or herbals. And uh, really, I saw immediate results. And that was really, really giving me a lot of hope that this would, would change. And it was amazing. And Dr. Bales went through with his, uh, his F scan and came up with a complete plan of how we were going to attack all these different types of infections that were uh, uh, systemic in my system. And uh, it made me feel really, really like I was, I was part of this and involved. And uh, we saw really good results. And I'm continuing to make progress with this. And I can't, if you're thinking about doing this, just do it. Because it's, it's really, really an amazing technology. And I'm a complete believer.